And it's those look like pretty tough conditions for tennis. How did you find it? Well, I don't think anyone likes to play in cold. So yeah, it wasn't well, it wasn't easy, but it wasn't easy for both of us. So, you know, it um, would be nice to play with you know, 23 degrees and no wind. But unfortunately, we can't get those conditions every single match, and we have to deal with it. So yeah, it's definitely you know it's difficult to play when your muscles are cold and try to keep yourself warm the whole match. And, but you know, I think. Um, it, I mean, it was uh, good tennis today, even though the conditions were tough. And uh, um, I felt like, you know, especially at the end of the match, was a really good uh, high level tennis. You must have been pleased with the, the fight that you put up. It was very spirited. Yeah, I felt, you know, I felt like I played, uh, played good tennis today. Um, at the beginning, I think for both of us, we didn't start really well. and. Um, but in a third set, I feel like um, it was um, good tennis and, uh, uh, you know, it's a great match to, uh, as a preparation for Australian Open. Like, I feel like I'm ready to have a good result at the, um, you know, next week at Melbourne. And, yeah, it's, it's, of course, frustrating to lose today, but I felt like I was just a little bit unlucky at the end. I had a break point and um, we had, like, a really weird point <laughs> there. And um, Yarko, Yarko won it, and and at 315, like um, at the ball cut, um, caught the net, and she had a seat there to have to hit the winner, backhand winner. So yeah, I, f I felt like I was right there, and I felt you know I moved really well on the board today, and um, my first serve was um, um, I, I I don't really know, but I felt like it was a high percentage of I put a lot of first serves in, and. Um, yeah, it's. Uh, I feel you know. I feel good on the court, and you know, good luck to Yarka for here this week. And yeah, it's. I, I I'm gonna still play doubles here and see how I go there. But you were over seventy percent first serve percentage. Were you happy with the way you were setting up your points, particularly on your serve? It was particularly good. Have you managed to serve that sort of consistency in the match uh, often over your career? Uh, at the end of last year, um, especially in Leeds, when I did quarterfinal, I had really high percentage of first serve, and I think that's, uh, um, you know, I feel like it's actually uh, a key of my game was to keep, to keep that high percentage because I don't have a serve um, like Yarko has, like 190 kilometers per hour every second month. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm not so po as powerful as she is, but I I feel like I'm I can be consistent. I move really quick and. Uh, you know, if I if I don't get a lot of free points to to the players, and I you're still, you know you're close to getting into that mark. Well, if you if you play six four and third against the player who've been top forty for a while, yeah, I, I feel like I'm really close. <laughs> you know, I I uh, I have no points to defend until I don't know. I think May. <laughs> So whatever, you know, as, as I said before, you know, if I if I do well in any tournaments, it's um, my ranking gonna improve. I don't think um, my ranking actually shows the way right now the way I play. I feel like I'm much better player, and you know, I think today's much proved it. I, yeah, I was I she won at the end, but I felt like you know I was right there, and um, you know, a few more days of practice, you know, I think I'm gonna. I'm going to play well at the Australian Open. Second set in particular, you played very well. I mean, was there anything different that was happening in that set? Um, my returns in the first set were not working at all. Like, I was making a lot of unforced errors. I, I gave her a lot of free points in the first set, so she was winning her serious game really easy. And um, in the second set, I, I concentrated more on uh, putting more returns in it, in it actually I felt like it put a lot of pressure on Yarka and she started making unforced errors. And um, as we all know that you know Yarka can hit a lot of winners and so she can make some unforced errors. So I've, like the key for me today was like to make to put her under pressure to make her feel as uncomfortable as possible on the court because if she has an easy second shot, you know, so like she she'll kill you. <laughs> so and so I was trying to put a lot of pressure on her serve, so that in you know she did double fold a few times, and she her uh, first serve wasn't working as well as it was in the first. So yeah, I I've, that's what I tried to do. But she 
um, she stepped up in the beginning of the third set and played few really good games. But I still managed to bro uh, break back and uh, not got to for all. But yeah, I think overall 